Good morning. It is Sunday morning, 10 o'clock. I haven't been able to sign in on DoorDash. I really don't want to anyways, because Dunkin' Donuts gets messed up on the weekends. And that's all I'm gonna, that's really the only place I'm delivering from right now. I've seen a couple good Instacarts, but I don't know if I'm just tired or other people's crack finger is, you know, more accurate right now. I just, I haven't gotten them. I really haven't felt like working. And I think that's part of it too. But I got this one. It's not the greatest order, but I don't know. I want to do something and almost all of it's produce. So this one, I should be able to shop for it really quick. Thank you so much. You just said it right there? Yep, no problem. Right, have a good one. You too, thank you. Yep. All right, got that Instacart dropped off. Instacart's out here taking more of the base pay and then stacking me with somebody who tipped $1.97. I shopped for 13 items for that miserable human being and they gave me $1.97. I hope somebody poops on them. All right, so this Instacart took me 38 minutes to get it get to the store, shop for it, drop it off. It was, I don't know, pretty involved. Just the one person ordered so much stuff and heavy stuff, but it says to leave it in front of their garage door. So that's as easy of a drop off as it can get. Unless I gotta walk like up their driveway or something. But yeah, this isn't the best order because the mileage is really high, but it's a straight shot down back roads which I like driving down back roads. And uh, yeah, I only need to make like 80 something dollars today to uh, reach my goal for the week. So this, this really makes it an easy day. almost uh dipshitted that first instacart drop off like that video i just the clip i showed you that is the wrong house after i took the picture i was like oh shit that's 331 no anyway I, it was supposed to be the house next door luckily i fixed it i sent the customer a second picture of the order in front of their house and said i almost left it at the wrong house have a great day so now we dropping off the second one which is 10 miles away So that Instacart took me an hour and 15 minutes from leaving my house to dropping it off. And I got a hike to make it back home or back into my area where I can deliver food. This is out in the sticks. All right, I accepted another Instacart and I did the, the coagulations because it's Sunday and I'm trying to make $1,000 for the week. And I'm at $997 right now. So 
this order will put me over and I probably won't do any more deliveries today or tonight. So this is probably gonna be a short video. I've been getting people thanking me for the short, no, for the long videos and then people talking crap sometimes when it's short videos. But when you're uploading every day, man, the way I'm doing this, like they're not all gonna be long and they're not all gonna be short, but some will be long and some will be short. All right, so this Instacart took about 11 minutes of shopping and 20 minutes from leaving my house to getting it in the car and rolling out. And one of the people earlier today marked me as their favorite chopper. So now I have 10 people who marked me as their favorite chopper, but I've never gotten an order that comes in that shows me that like this person picked me, you know, like that. I, I don't know if they even do that. A weird tree. All right, so I dropped the first Instacart off. Nice and easy. I thought it was a customer I've delivered to a bunch because of the building, but I think it was their neighbor. I don't know. Yeah, I'm on my way to drop off the second Instacart of this order, and I was getting ready to take a nap before I got this order, so I think making 40 bucks instead of taking a nap is a pretty good deal. All right, so that lady, Barbara, who I dropped off to last, she favorited me. That's 11 people who have favorited me. So at some point, we're gonna see what that does, like how the order, like how that benefits me. Cause so far, ain't done nothing for me. All right, so I said I was done a long time ago, but uh, yeah, I keep getting good Instacarts and like, you know, my house is so close to Food Lion that like, that's what I like about Instacart is how you don't get any kind of penalty for not accepting orders. So they can send me the trash all day. You know, most of them, I'm like, I don't even live close to that grocery store. I'm not looking at that grocery store. Anything that's not Food Lion or Giant, I'm not really looking at. And uh, yeah, so like this is another 25 bucks. This one not gonna take me an hour. Uh, this is good money. All right, so it took me 15 minutes to get to the store, shop for that Instacart, get it checked out, put it in the car, and now I'm five minutes away from the drop-off. This is a really good order. All right, so I'm gonna say that's gonna do it for this one. Uh, I'm not turning the app off yet, so I might be lying, but at this point in the day, which is 524, you know, I spent, there was a lot of time in between each delivery. I was chilling at home most of the day today. 
Anyway, I made $168.75 unless someone happened to increase a tip and then that is not the correct amount. But at right now, that's how much I've made. I worked for four hours and 15 minutes and I drove 53 miles. Freaking hit that subscribe button, watch the suggested video, or don't. I don't care. Tune in tomorrow or any day, 9 p.m. Take it easy. Have a great day.